the sixth series of strokes is a continuation of the fifth series. We're just in a different anatomical location. Now we're going to treat the lumbar spine. And we're now going to move the erector spinae from medial to lateral. So this is supported thumb technique. You can see that my wrist is in neutral. My flexed fingertips, they're doing the action of pushing Julianne's body. My thumb is resting on my flexed finger to scoop on the tissue. My support thumb is right next to that and doing the same stroke. So we're going to pull the skin back, sink in, and move it medially to laterally. Again, this is to mobilize the spine as well as treatment for the soft tissue. We can go up. Now, as you'll see in the next chapter, we're just going to continue the stroke into the thoracic spine. For teaching purposes, we're going to go back now, going down to the lumbar spine. And in your clinical setting, you can go back and forth, up and down this tissue, moving medially to laterally. You're also noticing that Julianne's whole body is rocking. Very important. Would not be good technique to scoop this way. Poor technique is to scoop your wrist like this. This will really wear out your wrist. The wrist stays in a neutral position. My body is generating the force to move the body, not this. My thumbs aren't scooping this way either. They're not gripping. So my hands stay very relaxed to do this. And I'm moving the tissue medially to laterally with the force of my body's movement rather than efforting from my hands and fingertips.